the the troop or your organization has actually evolved right over time and today you perform for presidents you have fortune 500 companies as clients tell us a little bit more about that part of your organization well I'll tell you what uh, the entire philosophy of improvisation is ba based on the philosophy of yes and where you don't say no to anything and that literally is how our business kind of grew as I said we, we had been doing this show for probably probably about a year, a year and a half. And there was a CEO who had come to our show and he said, hey, I really love what you guys do. Have you guys ever thought about doing corporate events? At that time, I had no idea there was even such a thing as a corporate event. But because we don't say no, we said yes, and we would love to do your, your event first. And they brought us in to perform at the end of one of their uh, national sales meetings. And we, we did the show. Well, we started realizing, oh, this is an avenue uh, of revenue that we never even knew it existed. And so we started um, more and more started doing a show here, a show there. And that ended up uh, leading to us where uh, we we're, we we're doing our regularly set scheduled show. There was a young kid who came up to us afterwards and said, I love what you guys do. Have you guys ever thought about teaching classes? Up to that point, never even considered it. But because we don't say no, we said yes and check the website. I believe we'll be starting classes very soon. And what we found was this show kind of built itself and opportunities kind of arose. And uh, as we built our, our corporate show, doing more and more of that, people started asking us, uh, business executives started asking us, can you teach this to business executives? And that's how we kind of created a training program for business executives, which led to our keynote. So everything has, it just kind of organically grew from itself, just from the philosophy of yes and, and not saying no to ideas. And then eventually that did lead to us doing a keynote for Congress where President Obama was in attendance and we did a show with President George W. Bush. All these things that I never in a million years could have ever thought would ever happen came from the philosophy of yes and and just not saying no. And it's been a beautiful journey.